better. How do you concentrate better? I think today it would be important for us to speak on the mobile phone for one minute to say, how can we allow ourselves to come in the house of Allah? We've made the effort, we made wudu, we managed to drive all the way here or to walk all the way here. We braved the heat or the weather conditions. As we walk in, it is nice and cool. And then we are sitting with our mobile phones and busy plugging in with everyone else on the globe. And whilst everyone is in salah, the Imam is about to say, And you hear this man's phone ring and the other man's phone ring and one of the sister's phones rings. And if the phone ring, it's one thing. But the tone itself is a disaster. It is really desecration of the masjid. Because those who are immoral, those who have engaged in the worst immorality in the world, and they have sung songs that are full of nudity, the same song we bring it as a ringtone into the house of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala without shame. If that's the case, where is our salah? Where is our salah? Let us inshallah achieve improvement on that i make an effort by the will of allah and i hope and i pray that i can benefit from what i have just said may allah make me conscious of my telephone when i walk in i switch it off i saw a sign as we were reading salah to say the phone must be switched off those should not just be signs implemented today when you see a camera and i saw so many in doha every traffic light there is a camera I want to say a point, you can take it how you want. I'm a foreigner here, but I learned something. Do you know how people fear the camera? No matter what, they will break so hard that the man behind them might hit them. They don't mind, but that 6,000, I must not get the fine. Am I right? It's true because we are worried. We have a fine. We are, we are going to be penalized. Something's going to go from our pocket if we cross and there is a camera flash. I want to say something you can take home. If we fear Allah, half of what we fear a camera, we would solve our problem. That's what I have said. You can take it how you want. You can disagree or agree. But I have seen people who will stop at the instruction of a camera, but they will not stop at the limit of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So this is what happens to us. If there is a policeman and we are not supposed to be talking on our mobile phone, we make sure the hands free is working. You tell me, is it more important to make sure your mobile is in the right place in your car or in the house of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? Which has greater sanctity? Which has more importance? How can we turn it upside down? Allahu Akbar. And then we want happiness, we want goodness. And I say, brother, I read five salah. Alhamdulillah, I read five salah a day. I'm happy. MashaAllah, improve your salah. Thank Allah, He has given you the ability to read five salah a day. But improve it. Take your time about it. Come a little bit earlier. When we are in a rush, our concentration goes.